There is nothing like the breathtaking and captivating sights and sounds of the Rainbow Nation of South Africa. This amazing country will touch you like no other country can. From the bustling modern cities of Johannesburg and Cape Town, to the colorful ethnic Ba Kap neighborhood, to the sun-soaked coast, there is no shortage of beauty, culture, and history in South Africa. Today, I'm going to show you 10 most beautiful places in South Africa. Before the video begins, please give it a like. And if you want to see more, please subscribe to the channel and let us know in the comments which country you want to see next. Now let's begin. Number 10. Gala Gadi Transfrontier Park, Northern Cape If you head to the remote Northern Cape region in the border area between South Africa, Botswana, and Nambia, you will run right into the largest wilderness areas on the planet, Galgadi Transfrontier Park. In 2000, this newly named park brought together the Kalahari Gemsbok National Park and Botswana's Gemsbok National Park. Hire a 4x4 and head out into the open veld for a dose of camel thorn trees, red sand desert, and unending blue skies. You will be in awe of the wildlife in this unique part of the Kalahari. From the elusive black mane Kalahari lion to the quirky families of meerkats, you will have more than enough chances to get that perfect safari photo. Keep an eye out for the elusive predators as well. You might find a leopard lounging in a camel thorn tree or a pack of hyenas scrounging for their next meal. Number 9. Stellenbosch and French Hawk South Africa has made huge waves in the wine world over the past few years, and some of the world's best wines can be found in Stellenbosch and French Hawk. The region is right next door to Cape Town and is a really cool day trip as you drive through the verdant mountainous nature reserves that surround these wine-producing towns. You will fall in love with the quaint little town of French Hoek with its white colonial Dutch buildings and friendly residents. Make sure to check out the history of the French settlers who came to the area to escape religious persecution. Sip in style as you take a tour through the many vineyards aboard the French Hoek Wine Tram, a double-decker open-air tram. Number 8. Isi Mangaliso Wetland Park, KwaZulu Natal. For those who have been to South Africa in the past, you may know Isi Mangaliso Wetland Park as Greater St. Lucia. No matter what the name, this UNESCO site in KwaZulu Natal is incredible. Isi Mangaliso is home to Africa's largest estuarine system, and its name means miracle and wonder in Zulu. You will find diversity in this park in every sense. Take your pick of coral reefs, crocodile-filled rivers, lakes, coastal dunes, swamps, and savanna. The variety of birds will amaze and entertain you as they flitter about among loggerhead turtles, elephants, leopards, and rhino. Number 7. The Garden Route Another incredibly amazing place to visit would be all the small towns and amazing scenery along South Africa's Garden Route in the Western Cape region. This route gets its name from the Garden Route National Park and this 125-mile area between Cape Town and the distinctively English town of Port Elizabeth is one of the world's most picturesque road trips. There are no shortages of amazing wildlife, lagoons, mountains, forests, and beaches along its scenic winding roads. You will marvel at the breathtaking vistas as you drive along the Indian Ocean through the campy beach towns and stunning national parks. A stop in the town of Hermanus is a great place to do some whale watching. Number 6. Cape Peninsula A trip down the Cape Peninsula will offer you unobstructed views of the sea and a chance to frolic among some very friendly penguins. Yes, there are penguins in Africa. Check out Boulder's Beach to visit the Rookery, a South Africa penguins who make the beach their home. Drive further south and you will eventually run into the Cape of Good Hope, the most southwestern point on the African continent. Enjoy the natural wild beauty of the Cape as you try to avoid the baboons who are on the lookout for some free food. Number 5. Pretoria and Johannesburg it is hard to describe the beauty of South Africa without a brief discussion on its troubled past. The truly extraordinary part of this country is the resilience of its people in the face of centuries-long oppression. There are two places in Pretoria and Johannesburg that are incredible not because of their natural beauty, but because of the fantastic people that represent these communities. The Apartheid Museum opened in 2001. Number 4. Cape Town Cape Town has to be one of the most beautiful cities in the world. It is full of history and diversity, and the surrounding area is simply breathtaking. It would take too long to give Cape Town the print space it deserves so. Let's hit the must-see spots of the amazing city. 
The Bolkap neighborhood is known for its pastel-colored houses lining the picturesque cobbled streets and has been the home of Cape Malay people from the Dutch East Indies for hundreds of years. The iconic Table Mountain stands tall, overlooking the bay, and offers views of the city bowl and surrounding areas that are unforgettable. A trip to Robin Island will move you as you hear the story of the troubled past of apartheid, apartness, that had a grip on South Africa for 400 years. Head to the V&A waterfront for great food, shops, and maybe a trip out to sea for some whale watching. Number 3. Cape Floral Region Protected Areas Cape Town If you're looking for a stunning site that is known for its flower power, then to check out the Cape Floral Region. It has been called the world's premier hotspot for plant diversity and is one of only six principal floristic regions on the planet. The number one attraction at this UNESCO site has to be Cape Town's Kirsten Bosch National Botanical Gardens. Even if plants are not your thing, you will be amazed at the floral mosaics on display. With Table Mountain looming large above you, you can get lost in paradise by meandering slowly along the well-marked paths. The best time to view the blooms is early spring, September slash October, since this is the Southern Hemisphere where the whole region bursts forth in a rainbow of brilliant color. Number 2. Kruger National Park, Limpopo slash Pumalanga Provinces There is no doubt that Kruger is the king of all African safari parks and the ultimate safari destination in the world. Kruger is also your best chance to get a glimpse of the Big Five up close and personal. The park is located in northeastern South Africa in the provinces of Limpopo and Pumalanga and is huge with an area of over 7,000 square miles. The park has been around for nearly a century and attracts thrill-seekers from all over the planet. There are no shortages of private safari companies and bush luxury bush camps to make your stay unforgettable. If you want to be right in the middle of the action and beyond, Ngala Safari Lodge offers it all. The lodge is a perfect fit for families as well as first-time and repeat explorers. A walled courtyard provides a sheltered space to indulge in extravagant cuisine, while the boma, a traditional African enclosure, creates a stunning setting for fire-lit dinners. Number 1. The Drakensberg Mountains The truly magnificent Drakensberg, or Dragon Mountains, stretch over 100 miles along the border between Lesotho and South Africa. This mountain range is a mecca for avid hikers of the world. This is due to the sheer grandeur, its accessible plateaus, and the many passes and slopes that make for some of the best climbing in Africa. You will be in awe of Drakensberg's famous mountain peaks like Giant's Castle and Cathedral Peak, but you will also be drawn to its foothills that are filled with incredible waterfalls, rock pools, mountain streams, and prehistoric caves. Thank you for watching and please hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, and enable post alerts to view more of our future videos. After saying that, keep watching our videos and I'll speak with you in the next one.